Welcome to episode 10 of Porch Popping with Verite News. I'm Roxy E. Wilson. And I'm DC Paul. Just in case you missed it, here's a few things you should know. Intergy New Orleans is threatening to sue the New Orleans City Council if they try to collect a $1 million fine for frequent power outages. The company has not yet filed a lawsuit, but it has sent a letter to the council warning them of the potential legal action. A council spokesperson says the company is welcome to challenge the fine through the regulatory process. The threat of litigation comes as the city and Intergy are negotiating a new contract for power service. The $1 million fine was imposed by the Louisiana Public Service Commission in 2022 after Energy was found to have violated its reliability. Standard. The company has argued that the fine is excessive and that it should be waived. The council originally imposed the fine in 2019 after an investigation confirmed there had been a sharp increase in power outages in recent years, but Intergy successfully sued the council to block the penalty due to the city council not having minimum reliability standards in place. The city council has said it is committed to collecting the fine, which it says will help to ensure that Energy provides reliable power service to New Orleans residents. And in this week's Lit Louisiana, here are some must-have for coffee table books that celebrate the beauty and culture of New Orleans. First, the mayor of New Orleans just talking jazz by Fatima Sheikh, where two fictional characters argue about whether New Orleans is an auditory or visual culture. Freedom's Dance, Social Aid and Pleasure Clubs in New Orleans by Karen Celestine and Eric Waters, a book of photographs with text that incorporates the elegance and uplifts the people we know as our neighbors. Picturing Black New Orleans, a Creole photographer's view of the early 20th century by Arthe A. Anthony, shows images of our local citizens at their best in the photo studio of Floristine Perot Collins. And New Orleans is in and now by Lester Sullivan, a deceased longtime archivist at Xavier University. His was an early volume celebrating the city's memorable cityscapes. The book pictures several locations that played important roles in past events. Thank y'all so much for watching episode 10. For more truth, facts, and fairness, please visit us at veritatenews.org and follow us across all social media platforms. We'll see y'all next week.